I know I don't usually make these videos anymore. I did make these before, but at the same time, considering the fact that today was my final day, I'm going to do a poster and a short. Well, I can have a decision on making other shorts and posters on different places. I'm just not interested. I decided to make this video to dedicate my final project to on my college to show you guys. First, let's get the shot out of the way. Instead of having the main characters go on the shot, I decided to have characters, background characters and support characters to be on this poster. This is obviously MOP. And I really did everything I can to get most of the supporting and background characters that I like the most. I mean, I could have had more, mainly the mo the moms of the main six, but at the same time, I couldn't able to find the victors, and I really wasn't interested in it. And as for everything that I did, it looks kind of, you know, squished in like. This wasn't supposed to be the end line, but at the same time, it just it's supposed to be a thing that gets printed out. And the, what I did after this is that I put this over. So th this is actually mailed. My teachers didn't bother because it, it, there was no letters on here. So I was pretty upset, but it didn't bother me afterwards. And I had to iron it really, 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 really good just so everything could get sticked on now. And it pretty much worked except for this area right here because this area, they told me to wash it and it'll be all gone. Which is not going to be an issue whether I need to wear this shirt. I really did what I can. The only character we haven't seen from the show is Princess Amor. I only put that there because... I basically like her design. I'm no, I know she isn't going to be part of season 9, but I think that seeing this right here, I really want to put her on because it's really the only choice that I have. Anyway, that's basically what I have for this poster. There's so many ponies on here. Star Trek, or Windy Whistles, The Perfect Pearl. I'm, I'm going to make a video discussing that they should return in season 9. Yeah, a last minute decision but at the same time we only have one more season left and we get to see the washouts um uh, oops sorry there was a notification we can see crystal ponies the Kaylin so I can't spell that Mrs. Shy and all those other characters like Sambo and Sunbird I really think that I really enjoy putting these together because I pretty much know that I'm not going to be able to have the chance to do this again. I mean, I do, but at the same time, I can't do anything better like this, like having so many characters. I did this on a computer, not on my iPad. Anyway, next is the poster. This is the small one that represents of what I got. And this is, this is the, this is actually the print thing, sorry, it's a print paper. And this is actually the poster. I thought it was going to be bigger, but I guess this is basically the best thing that I can do. There's a lot going on, which represents my hobbies of things. And as you can see, the bottom, uh, I was kind of close, and look at that. The, the, the fly pigment, the, what do you call it? Oh my god. I really feel bad for him. He had like the worst angle on this image and it's really sad to see that he got the worst out of most of the Pikmin in this. Now anything anything on this represents my hobbies and what I want to do when it comes to reviewing. The Drake and Josh and iCarly thing, I had to have iCarly block the, you know, the Drake and Josh logo because I, I didn't have any other choice to put them on though since that their bodies are completely cut, cut in this image. So I really don't have, well the bottom of the bodies are cut. So I had to easily put them in a situation when they had to be in front of the Drake and Josh logo. There you see Wamba Dash, Too Light. Yeah, I'm going to call them Too Light because it's a shipping name that I can think of. And up here, Hannah Montana. I'm still going to do reviews of it, but I don't know when. I'm, I'm really trying my best to think about if I'm going to do a That's So, a, a that's so Waven and Hannah Montana Marathon. But at the same time, I'm really burned out on Marathons right now. 
Link and Zelda from Spell Tracks, Astro Boy, Dialga, Adventure Time characters, Ratchet and Clank, Sonic the Werehog from Sonic Unleash, Mario and Yui, Mario and Yoshi from Super Mario Galaxy 2, S -S classic Sonic characters from Sonic Mania, The Social of Dark Magic from the Yu-Gi-Oh! movie, Kyle Wen, Spider-Man, well, sorry I forgot the name, from the Into the Spider-Verse movie, which I'm going to get on my birthday next month. Jenny from My Life as a Teenage Robot, and three wrestlers that I really enjoyed in other promotions. AJ Styles, Seth Rollins, and Ricochet. Really enjoy these characters, really enjoy these wrestlers. And here we get to see Robots. The reason why I pick Robots is because I found a really underrated movie. In my May of 2019 schedule of release on my YouTube uploads, I'm going to discuss on why it's an underrated movie well the video when it comes out not the schedule anyway up here we see impact wrestling which i know impact i know tna isn't a thing anymore but considering the fact that impact is just basically tna which is without the name i decided to put it on there because i think this is like the best photo that i could probably saw from any of the impact logos Anyway, here is Rainbow Dash, who is in her C point form because that's the only form that I enjoyed from her mostly. Up here, we see the Hulk from the Avengers, Blue, who is the Velociraptor from the Jurassic World movies, and SpongeBob. Yeah, that's basically all I have on this. The reason why I completely made this is because I know this is going to be the last. Postal, and I did make another postal last year. However, I decided to have all the stuff, which is from character cutouts and everything on here. And this is the best that I can do when it comes to what I enjoy and what I show on my YouTube channel. As much as I really want to have this as my ban as my channel banner, I'm going to have to do something else, like making a different banner. Anyway, I really hope that you enjoyed this video. I know it's not a video that you probably have any expectations from me, but at the same time, I really got nothing else to do today. Because later on, I'm going to do another fanfic reading. Yeah, I'm going to do a fanfic reading. So it's going to be a thing going on for the next couple months. I'm going to discuss of what I why I keep why I keep doing that in my May of 2019 schedule that I'm going to be uploading on the 30th, which is about a month, about a week. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoy this and know these are not for sale. Of course, if you see the beginning, I always put the copyright disclaimer in. Though this is just this follow this shirt and this. Poster is mainly for myself and nothing more, so don't expect me to actually make a thumbnail or anything. When it comes to making thumbnails, it's just usually it's just for the video only. That's it, just so it can be HD and stuff. Stuff like this, I made several shots and though and several posters and they're mostly for me. Just keep this in mind. It's really difficult for me to actually continue on doing so many different things. Anyway, I'm Lonely Fanboy for here, and I'll see you later today or tomorrow while I upload another fanfic reading from J. David. A, a, a story from J. David is what I mean.